Hey everyone, we are going to do a few yoga poses. Hey everyone, uh, for this, everyone we're going to flow through some yoga poses and add in a little bit of high intensity training feel free to have a block or um, perhaps a big uh, cookbook or other kind of book near you if you need a little prop and um, feel free to use weights as well always listen to your body and you can take or leave whatever you like so we'll begin in a child's pose just to warm up slightly Take a few cleansing breaths here. One more deep inhale through the nose and side out through the mouth. Next inhale, come up to your tabletop pose. Cycle through a few rounds of cat and cow. Inhale is cow pose. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. And exhale, cat. Begin to tuck your toes under. Hover your knees just above the surface of the mat. Puff up that space between your shoulder blades. Have a nice flat back. You can gaze between your index fingers here. See if you can check in with your knees. Maybe you peek down with them. Notice how far they actually are off of the ground. <laughs> Engaging through the belly, building up some heat. Five, four, three, two, one. Next, exhale, hips go up and back, coming to downward facing dog. You might have to adjust a bit here. Pedal out your heels. Sometimes it feels good to look under one armpit and then the other as you bend and straighten through each knee. And finding some stillness, we'll take two cycles of breath. Head and neck hanging heavy. On your next inhale, right leg will lift up, flex through the foot, toes pointed down, push the mat away with your hands here. Exhale, draw your knee to your chest. Stack your shoulders over wrists. Inhale, right leg lengthens. Exhale, knee to chest. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, knee to chest. And step your right foot all the way through between your hands. Left hand stays planted, right arm reaches up. Come up to the left fingertips, inhale, brings you all the way up to twisted crescent lunge. Inhale through center. Exhale, airplane your arms, torso hovers over your thigh. Inhale through center. Exhale, plant your hands down towards the mat. A few test pumps off that left foot. Left foot will step up to meet the right forward fold at the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise up, mountain pose. As you exhale, find your way to chair pose. Weight is in your heels here. Sometimes it feels good to cactus the arms, draw your shoulder blades back, and then extend arms back up. Inhale to rise, mountain pose. Exhale, chair pose. Inhale, rise. Exhale, lower. Widen out your stance slightly. Inhale, brings you up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Find a squat pose <clears throat> or chair pose with a little wider foot in here. Inhale, rise. Exhale, squat it down. Maybe go a little bit deeper. Keep going at your own pace. Inhale, brings you up. 
Exhale, squat it down. We're here for five, four, three, two, one. Hold, five, four, three, two, one. Forward fold, heel toe your feet back together. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, brings you all the way up, mountain pose. Maybe take a little back bend at the top. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant hands, step back, high plank pose. Hips go up and back, downward facing dog. Hinge forward, high plank. Option to bring your knees to the earth. Engage through the quads, feel your kneecaps lift. Hug your elbows in towards your ribcage, lower all the way down to the mat. Untuck your toes. Inhale, baby cobra. Exhale, chin to mat. Inhale, baby cobra. Exhale, release. One more inhale. We're gonna hold for two cycles of breath. Option to float your hands above the mat, pulling shoulder blades together. Last inhale, exhale, release down. Tuck your toes under, feel kneecaps lift, engage the quads, inhale. Exhale, push up high plank pose, and then downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg rises, flex through the left foot. Exhale, knee to chest as shoulders stack over wrists. Inhale, left leg rises. Exhale, knee to chest. Inhale, left leg rises. Exhale, knee to chest, step it all the way through. Right hand plants, left arm reaches up. Exhale, left hand to the mat. Inhale, reach it back up once again. Come up to the fingertips on your right hand and then on a strong inhale, rise up, twisted crescent lunge. Inhale through center. Exhale, airplane your arms. Inhale, center. Exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, center. Exhale, plant your hands down. Take a few test pumps off the right foot. Right foot steps up to meet your left. Forward fold at the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, chair pose. Widen out your feet so they are a little bit wider than your hips. Sink your hips a little bit lower, sitting in that imaginary Ikea chair. Inhale, brings you up, mountain. Exhale, sit it back down. Inhale, rise. Exhale, lower. We're here for five. Four, three, two, one, and hold. You can find stillness or a little pulse in motion. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, brings you up, bring your feet together, and exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, plant hands, step both feet back, coming into your high plank pose. <clears throat> Option to bring your knees to the earth, getting in a few yogi push-ups, squeezing elbows in, lower halfway down. Inhale, press up. Exhale, lower. Inhale, press up. One more, exhale, lower and hold. Five, four, three, two, one, press it up and downward facing dog. Take a sigh out through the mouth. Deep breath in. Sigh out, maybe you make some noise here. Inhale, right leg rises. Exhale, right knee to right elbow. Down to your right wrist. 
over to the left wrist, up to the left elbow, back to the right elbow, send it up high. One more like this, right elbow, right wrist, left wrist, left elbow, right elbow, send it up high. Step your right foot through, inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, airplane the arms. Palms can face down. Feel your triceps engage. Check in with the low belly. Shoulders pull away from ears. If you have weights, you can start to curl them. If you don't have weights, little pulses can help here. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, brings you up. Then we're going to take a one-legged mountain pose, so draw your left knee up with you. And exhale, step it back, airplane arms. Inhale, brings you up, one-legged mountain. Exhale, step it back. Now we're going to take it in slow motion. Weight comes into the right foot. Inhale, left leg rises, one-legged mountain. Slow motion, exhale, step it back. One more, inhale, slow motion. Exhale, step it back. Open up, warrior two pose. Inhale, right leg straightens, arms reach up overhead. Begin to turn your right foot. All your toes are facing this side. Heels can turn in slightly, toes turn out. Cactus your arms here, bend into the knees. Begin to guide your right elbow down to get close to your right thigh. Maybe it gives a tap, maybe not. Inhale, brings you back through center. Exhale, take this over to the left. Continue. We're here for 10 more seconds. Taking your time. Five, four, three, two, one, that was probably way longer than 10 seconds. Inhale, arms reach up, toes turn to face the side of your mat, and forward fold. <clears throat> How did I can have you find a little bit of calmness here for a moment? Walk your hands underneath your head. Inhale to a halfway lift. Exhale, walk hands to the top of the mat. Right foot is still forward, left foot is back. From here, we're gonna move into a side plank. The left hand will come to the top middle of your mat. Start to roll over to the knife edge side of your left foot as your right leg comes back. You can take as many little steps as you need here to adjust. Option to bring your left knee to the earth. Maybe you float that top leg. Come into a tree pose. We're here, five, four, three, two, one. Closing it down, downward facing dog. Inhale, brings you forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg rises. Taking those little rectangles here. Exhale, left knee to left elbow. Down to left wrist. Right wrist, right elbow, left elbow. Send it back. Once more, left wrist, left, <laughs> left elbow, left wrist. Right wrist, right elbow, woo, left elbow. Send it on back. Step that left foot through. Inhale, rise, crescent lunge. <sighs> Exhale, airplane your arms. From here, palms can face down. If you have the weights, being careful to pull shoulders away from ears, giving a little pulses if you don't have the weights. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, brings you back up. One-legged mountain pose. Exhale, drive right knee up towards chest. Inhale here. 
Exhale, step it back, airplane arms. Inhale, draws right knee up. Exhale, step it back. One more. Stepping it back. Now we're taking it slow motion. Weight comes into the left foot. Inhale, slowly rise, drawing right knee with you. Slow motion, step it back. Feeling that left uh, outer glute engage. Inhale, slowly draws right knee. Exhale, slowly steps it back. Inhale, rising arms up overhead. And then exhale, open warrior two pose. Inhale, left leg straightens, arms reach. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, rise. Shift your left foot, all your toes will face the right side of the mat. I'm going to turn around so you don't get to see the back side of me. And then begin to turn heels in, toes turn out. Coming back to those cactus arms. And then from here, just start to draw your elbows together and then bend from the hips, lowering down. Push elbows together, inhale, rise. Exhale, lower. Inhale, rise. Nice, slow, controlled movement. Really push those elbows together. Forearms, we'll take two more. You might have gotten an extra run in there. Inhale brings you all the way up. Five point and star. Make yourself big. And then as you exhale, warrior two pose. And then cactus your arms down. I'm going to switch out my feet so I'm matching you. <clears throat> Inhale as left leg arm reaches up. And then coming into that funky side plank. Right hand comes to the top middle, roll into the knife edge side of your right foot. Left foot will step it back. Take your variation on this side, making a nice arc shape with your body as you push the mat away with that bottom hand. Maybe you float the top leg. Sometimes it helps to actually flex through your foot. Five, four, three, two, one, closing it down, you can flow through a vinyasa or go right to downward facing dog. Breath in here, and sigh out. Inhale, brings you forward to your high plank pose. Come down onto your forearms. And then moving into dolphin pose, Start to walk your toes up towards your elbows. You'll begin to feel your shoulders stack over your elbows. Maybe your head comes down onto the ground. From here, if you'd like to get in a few little kicks, start to lift the right or left leg up, bend into your right knee, and then kick it up. Can also stay in that dolphin pose. Left foot comes down, bring knees to the mat, child's pose. As I catch my breath, rising back up. Bring your legs to extend to the back of the mat, coming back into your forearm plank. We have to do the other side. So as you're ready, starting to walk your toes in towards your elbows, hips reaching high. This time, if you'd like, right leg lifts, bend into the left knee and then kick it up. This is something I'm working on. So taking you guys with me, right foot returns to the mat, bring your knees down, child's pose. If you'd like, moving into rabbit pose, guiding hands towards your heels. Hands 
Hands can come back to the mat and you rise up slowly. You can roll out your wrists one way and then the other. Draw hands to your low back, intertwine fingers. Pull shoulders away from your ears. Home stretch here, coming back to tabletop and then downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg rises. Exhale, knee to chest. Inhale, right leg rises. Exhale, right knee to right elbow. Inhale, rise. Exhale, right knee to left elbow. Inhale, rise. Exhale, step right foot through. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, airplane arms, pulses here. Five, four, three, two, one, inhale, draw left knee up with you, one-legged mountain pose. Begin to extend your left leg out in front. Pulses here if you'd like. Five, four, three, two, one. Slowly send the left leg back. Arms can reach towards the back of the rim as well. Bend into the left leg. Imagine you're holding something yummy on the top of your foot. Inhale, brings you up, one-legged mountain pose. Exhale, send it back, keeping the left leg bent. One more time like this. Then we're gonna extend back, keeping that left leg bent, and then pulses at the top. Five, four, three, two, one, right knee bend, step the left leg back, crescent lunge. Exhale, open warrior two. Inhale, rise. Right leg straightens, arms reach up overhead. Heels dry and toes turn out. Cactus arms. Left elbow towards left thigh. Inhale, center. Exhale, right elbow, right thigh. Two more on each side. Draw elbows together, forearms press together. Inhale, lift. Exhale, slowly lower. Inhale, brings you up. Exhale, lower. Take two more. Last one. Inhale, brings you all the way up. Arms reach, five point and star. Exhale, hands towards your hips and forward fold, release it down. Hands to the mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale as you walk hands back to the top of the mat. From here, step your left foot up to meet your right. Forward fold at the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rises you up, mountain pose. Exhale, chair pose. Bring your feet a little bit wider than hip width. Yeah, we're coming back to those squats. Squat a little bit down. Inhale, brings you up. Exhale, lower. Five. Four, you can always bring your hands to heart center. Three, two, one, and sink it down. Pulses here. Five, four, three, two, one. Mountain pose, feet together. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your hands, step it back, high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg rises. Exhale, knee to chest. Inhale, rise. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale, rise. Exhale, left knee, right elbow. 
Inhale, rise. Exhale, step it through. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, crescent. Exhale, airplane arms. Air, arms stay here. Pulses, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, draw right knee with you. One-legged mountain pose. Exhale, send it back. <clears throat> Inhale, rise. You forgot to extend, or I forgot. Begin to extend the right leg out. Exhale, send it back. Bend into that right leg. Imagine something yummy on the top of your right foot. Don't let it spill. Inhale, brings you back up. Exhale, send it back. Inhale, rise. Exhale, send it back. We're going to hold here, keeping that right knee bent and little pulses. Five, four, three, two, one. Left knee bent. Step your right leg back. Crescent lunge. Exhale, open. Warrior two pose. Inhale, left leg straightens. Arms reach up overhead. I'm going to spin myself around. Cactus arms here, heels in, toes out. You know where we're going. Three on each side. Last one. And elbows together, reach up slightly. Exhale, slowly lower you down. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. And then from here, release your hands down towards the mat. Straighten through the legs, toes face the wall or the side of your mat, making a wide number 11. Take a prasarita pose for a moment. You can bring your hands to the outer edges of your ankles or feet. Maybe you sway a bit from side to side. Hands come back underneath your head if you're ready. Inhale to a halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, walk hands back up towards the top of your mat. Step your back foot up to the top, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. I bet you can guess where we're going. Inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to heart center, wide not your feet. Last time, squat. Inhale. Stay for the exhale. Inhale brings you up. Here we go. Exhale, sink it back. Inhale, rise. Exhale, sink it back. Three more. Two. Last one. Bring it back down. See if you can bring your feet a little bit closer together. And then sink your hips. Keep sinking, keep sinking until you can come all the way down to your mat, land in a boat pose that may not be graceful and that is okay. Hands can come behind your thighs on the floor or reaching out in front. Feel some openness through the chest here. We don't want to be hunched over. If that means lowering your feet down, go for it. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring your feet to the mat. Hug your shins, let your forehead rest. You need to lift your head, lift your right foot off of the mat, arms release out in front, and then left foot lifts as well. Let your right heel dip towards the mat, press it up, left heel, Press it up. See where we're going. We're here for 10 more seconds. You can always bring your hands down if that feels better. Five, four, three, two, one. Extend your legs out, low boat. Five, four, you got this. Three, two, 
One, lower all the way down. Take a full body stretch. Maybe an open mouth sigh. Thank your body for all it has done for you already. Draw your knees in towards your chest. Give a little rock from side to side. Begin to rock the length of your spine. Home stretch here, rock yourself up. <clears throat> Bring your hands to heart center. And then we're going to begin to guide our right elbow to the outside of the left hip. Inhale, center. Exhale, left elbow towards outside of right hip. If you'd like a little bit more intensity, lower down your back closer to the mat. If you'd like even more, begin to float your heels off. Inhale, will bring you back through center. Exhale, brings you to the twist. We're here. Breathing. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And through center, let it go all the way down. Take another full body stretch. <sighs> Draw your knees back in. Don't worry, we're all done. Guide them to the outer edge of your torso. Happy baby pose. Reach for outsides of feet or ankles. Give a little rock from side to side. Release your feet down, cross the right leg over the left like you're sitting in a chair. Arms come out like wings and then let your knees drift over to the left side of the room. You can gaze up or over to the right. And stay here as long as you like. When you feel ready, draw your knees back up through center. Uncrossing, taking this on the opposite side, left leg over right, and then letting knees drift over to the right as you gaze over left fingertips, if that feels okay on your neck. Feet is starting to slow down, breath is slowing down. You can come back up through center when you feel ready, uncrossing left leg. Draw your right knee in, left leg can extend out long. Maybe you open up the right knee out towards the right hip, rolling out your ankle. Inhale, back through center, extend the right leg up towards the ceiling. Hands can come behind your right thigh. Keep as much of a bend as you need in the right leg. You might even float your hands up towards your top calf. Feeling a hamstring stretch, but not forcing anything. Right knee bends, left knee draws in, right leg extends out. Option to guide your left knee up and out towards your left armpit. Inhale, back through center, extend left leg up towards the ceiling, taking your hamstring stretch on this side. Notice how it feels when you flex your right foot as well, trying to lengthen through the leg that is on the mat. Releasing all the way down as you invite both legs onto the mat. Check in with yourself if there are any last wiggles or poses you need. And then when you're ready, guide your body down, taking on whatever shape you need for a bit of stillness and shavasana, knowing you can stay here as long as you like. When you feel ready, rolling over to whatever side feels best, taking your time, pressing yourself up. 
arriving in a seated position, bringing your hands to heart center, thanking your body and yourself for taking this time for you, for growing stronger in spirit and mind and body. From my heart to yours, namaste.